Hello, everybody. Um, good evening. I just want to apologize for the lateness. Um, we had a few um, technical difficulties that we had to take care of. Um, but now we're here. We're back. Um, it's really nice to be back um, teaching this open class for everybody. Um, my name is Lucy Turbe. I'm originally from Puerto Rico. I'm a dance instructor for uh, Dance Theater of Harlem School. And a few weeks uh, ago, I was here teaching you bomba class, and we learned how to dance Sika from the north east of the island. And also we learned bomba from Loisa. Today we're gonna learn bomba from the south of the island, Quembe. Uh, bomba is an African rhythm that start at the end of the 17th century of the island with, when the central and west African uh, towns like San Juan, Santurce, Loiza, eh, Ponce, Mayagüez. Uh, um, daily Bomba is used as a uh, resistance music. Uh, now it's been happening a lot of things in the world. Uh, Puerto Ricans use the bomba to protest and make the speak up for any difficulty or troubles that they are um, having right now. So we're gonna start, I'm gonna wait a few minutes to see who else connect and then we're gonna start with a warm up, and then we're gonna learn bomba cuembe from the south is a little uh, slower rhythm. Last time that we danced together, it was a faster rhythm that it was the Bomba from Loisa. And let's wait two, two minutes. For this class, I um, wanna try like a male figure. So you don't need a skirt and you everything are gonna do it with your hands. And, and with your arms, using your elbows and everything. Okay, if we're ready to start, you're gonna come to the center. You will need a small space at home where you can move around and create a walk a circle. And we're gonna start in the middle of the space. Here we go. Six, seven, let's be ready. And one. Five. One more time. And one. Here we go. Two count. And one. Five. 
Yeah. Thank you. Now it's the warm up. So thank you for joining me. I said before, we're going to learn QMB. The basic step, let's start with our feet together and we're going to place our arms, arms in our hips. We're going to go step, go back, step, close, back, step, close. Open, step, close, open, step, close. And we go open, step, close, open, step, close. Open, step, close, to start. Okay, so we go one, back, open, we open the body a little bit, step and close back and open and bring the body back to the center. So we go one, two, just that. We are going to try to do it with music, only that, with very slow music. Eight to 
the left front, travel one, two, three, four, travel back, one, two, three, four. If you don't have a skirt, so your arms are gonna stay here. We go one, and two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. Travel front, and one, Two, three, four, back, one, two, three, four. Let's try it with music. Work Bomba Originate or Bomba Originate, the Central and West African slave came to the island to work in the sugarcane plantation. So let's practice our step. Here we go. Skirt to the front. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. To the front. One. Thank <laughs> you. 
when you go to dance in a bombazo or you're gonna dance in a bate, the bate is the dance floor, you have the drummers in one corner. And the first thing that you do is a paseo. We just learned the paseo. So paseo is when you walk around on the dance floor, right? But you do it with the basic step. So we just did a circle. So this is how you enter to the dance floor. You do a circle and you always show respect to the drummers and offer the dance to the ancestor. Okay, and after that, that's called paseo. Now we do the piquetes. Piquetes are the movement that the dancer do that the, uh, the primo, uh, the barril, play for you. So it's a conversation between the drummer and the dancer. You do the movement, the drummer plays for you. So now we're gonna learn a uh, combo. So we're gonna go from one corner, or you can do it from one side to the other one, you choose because bomba is very, um, you have a lot of freedom, right? I'm gonna give you just the basic piquetes so you can adapt it and do it you on, right? So I'm gonna do it from a corner, diagonal. And if you don't have a square, you're just gonna do your arms like this, from one side to the other one. If you have a piece of fabric, scarf, or a skirt, you're just gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do that one more time. We're gonna do the paseo and this. Let's practice that piquete. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Your arms just do this and your legs are just stepping one, two, one, two, just to be able to move forward, right? That's what your legs do. So, we gotta do A of this and A piquetes. Let's try with music until there. Here we go. Two. 
let's review. So we go front after we do this once. The accent is go up, out to that side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You one. Turn around. From the shoulder out. Two. Round. Three. Around. One, two, three, four. From there, we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. So we finish here after the turn that we do one, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four. Let's put everything from the top until there. This time, we're gonna do a paseo. Let's do eight in place, eight counts de paseo, and we start with the piquete. Five, six, five, six, seven, and one. Oh, 
shuffle back. One, two. If you don't have uh, you don't have score, you go one and two. You're you're asking for the drummer to play harder. Give me golpe. Golpe is when they do uh play the drums. So you one, two, so we're gonna go in a six stack. One, two, switch three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If you have a skirt, you finish here, here, seven, eight. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do it with music from the top to there. How you doing? I know that you're doing very good. Uh -huh. Just have fun. Enjoy the music of the drum. Let it go. Just feel the drum. Five, six, five, six, seven, on.
I know by myself, I'm just gonna do it. I improvisation of what other things or how you can do this a little bit faster or switch a step and do this step in different orders. Because when you go to dance to El Bateo, when you're dancing in a bombazo, well, you don't wanna do a choreography, you want to improvise. So I'm giving you these steps so you can use it in different order, different sides, different arms. Just do this step, make this step as your own, okay? So when you go to a bombazo, you know how to dance, right? So let's do try the choreography one more time, and then you improvise and do your own dance with the steps that I that you learned today. Ready? Five, six, five, six, seven, eight, one. Thank you. 
It was a pleasure for me to be here today. I, I apologize one more time for the technical issues that we have at the beginning of the class. Um, if you wanna know more about Bomba, you can Google it also. If you wanna learn how to dance Bomba from Santurce or Sica or Bomba from Loisa, you can find those videos in the Dance Theater of Harlem YouTube channel. Thank you for joining me. Have a beautiful evening. Hugs to everybody. Stay safe.